Excuse me. Good morning. You hoping for a lottery and ticket or something? Hey, I think someone far away is calling you. Go see him. What do you think you're doing here? Listen up. No more warnings. That's it. Yeah, Keep going. Yeah, yeah. Hello everyone, welcome to the channel you're watching Horizon Rover. Today is Monday 4th of September 2023 and this video is about today's daily challenges and Madam's allocation in Red Dead Online. Today she is at Borja Glade, not far away from Rhodes, and the list of daily challenges for today is the next one. It's one clothing style updated, you can do that easily while you're riding your horse. If you have any saved outfits in your saddlebags, just swap to them. Or go to the wardrobe, any wardrobe, and change any item of your clothing. So let's do that now. And this challenge is completed. Alright, I'll keep that outfit for now. Then the next daily challenge is 5 fish caught with a lure. Obviously you use the lure to catch any fish. Uh, special spinner lure will do. 5 fish caught with food, for that you have to use cheese, bread or corn as a bait while fishing. Then 5 milkweed picked and you can see the locations for the milkweed. 3 non-play enemies killed with a Maxim gun. You can get a Maxim gun on some encounters, free roam encounters like hideouts or rival moonshiners. Try not to kill too many non-play enemies before you will get to the Maxim gun there. Another option is go to progress, go to story missions, then a land of opportunities. And here you can play Curse in Tyrant and Greed, more than one way turn and back. Both of them will start if you have negative on a level. Or if you have positive on a level then kill them each and every one. But I would prefer to go to the more than one way turn and back or kerosene tower and grid. And if you want to make it difficult, tap left, go to telegrams, go to rough justice and start the bell tolls. On that mission you'll find some maxing guns even on the wagon and you can use them. But it's quite difficult there because some NPCs are shooting dynamite arrows and yeah, but it could be really fun. So I'll actually challenge you to complete it there. On the telegram mission. Then one place top three in a shootout showdown. Obviously join shootout showdown, stop left, go to quick join and play shootout series here. Sometimes it depends on your luck. If you will join the winning team, even at the end of the match, you will complete the daily challenge. Then the next one three play kills with a repeater in showdowns. Obviously take your repeater, for example Lancaster repeater, and use your repeater to kill three other players. To make sure that your kills accounted for the daily challenge, you have to start the showdown from the real beginning of the showdown, where you have the pretty much lobby, or at least you had a full intro for that showdown. If not, your kills won't be counted, but it's not a problem, you can wait for the next showdown to start and it will be counted in the next one. Oh, that's a player. For the bounty hunter, today we have two bounty targets taken down with bolus. One hard legendary bounty mission is completed. You can switch the type or difficulty of the bounty mission by the bounty board. One player bounty is collected. Whenever you're gonna see any player bounty available, always go for it. For the trader, it's 15,838 feet distance delivery wagon trial on a mission. Six large animal carcasses donated to creeps, and seven medium animal carcasses donated to creeps. For the collector, five bird eggs found. I'll show you the locations for the duck eggs. There will be 5 of them in the nest, so make sure you don't have more than 5 in your satchel already. 2 collectibles found with a metal detector, they are usually coins and fossils, and 3 family helms found. Let's open the map for...
for the family heirlooms. I hope I have it. Yeah, there it is. So today you'll find your family heirlooms by roads, actually at roads. Then another one at Blackwater, and one more probably at the Hotel of Valentine. Five duck eggs today you'll find at Oak Creek's Run Lake at this location here. Oh, look at that. Probably that guy is taking a picture of himself with that fish. <laughs> nice. Right, then next we have. Munchener, it's $200 made from Munchen sold for Munchen served to other players at the bar. Just invite some players to your bar and serve for drinks, even to the same player will do for the daily challenge. Or if you'll see an invite to the Munchen Shack accepted and probably that player wants to complete this daily challenge, so you can serve for drinks to him and he can serve for drinks to you. One Munchen sold with at least 18 bottles intact. When you're selling your Munchen, drive carefully because you got 20 bottles in total in your wallet. For the night choice, it's 7 crafted to cook at Wilderness Camp. Don't kill an animal for 24 game hours, it's 48 real life minutes and 1 legendary animals photograph. You can do that in free roam on Harriet's missions. Protect the legendary animal free roam event as well. And looks like on wild animal tagging free roam event, but I personally didn't see many legendary animals over there but i've been told that there are some at least one on that i hope you found this video helpful thanks for watching have a nice day and see you next time oh there's a legendary animal <laughs> nice let's go and take a picture hopefully that player won't go for that animal i've seen it first what's that legendary fox Need the camera. Oh, it's too late now. Right, I have to revive it and then quickly take a picture of it. Let's check if I got my camera ready. Yeah, it is here. Revive. Come on! What the hell? Too far away? Oh no! Come on! Horse! I need some clear area where I can take a normal picture. For example, here. I can pull out the camera now. There is. <laughs> oh, looks like I have found one collectible with a metal detector here. You should know this place. It's by Emerald Ranch. That little farm here. Somewhere here. I'll open them up. That's the location. And a lot of milkweed around here. Nice. 